Hi everyone, Terry Davis here with Profound Talent. Okay, today I want to talk about consistency. So I was actually watching uh, you, uh, Facebook the other day and a friend of mine actually posted on this and I wanted to bring it forward because it had a bit of a light bulb effect with me in a couple areas and uh, you think how hard is you know consistency? It sounds like something pretty easy. Why do we need to explain it? But it did really become a powerful um, video that I was watching because it hit home to me in one aspect of my life where I recognized I am not consistent. So um, I am consistent in my business. I am very methodical in my approach. I have always been very consistent and committed to my business and uh, I have always succeeded in business because of it. The one challenge I have in my life is with exercise and diet. I am always on that roller coaster of I'm gonna eat well this week and I'm gonna get out and work out and then all of a sudden I do that for a while and then I fall off that bandwagon and I let other things take priority and I do not contain or do not maintain a consistent approach in my methods with that and ultimately what happens is I see some short-term wins but I don't see long-term effects to to that and I don't see myself reaching my goals in that area so she happened to come on board and was doing a Facebook video live about consistency and it's interesting because my friend actually happens to be a fitness trainer so of course she is super consistent when it comes to fitness and food and not as consistent sometimes in her area of business. So it was really interesting dynamic because I watched her and I thought, you know what, that's exactly it. I need to put more consistency, if I put consistency into my world when it comes to fitness, health, diet. I eat right on a consistent basis versus eating right for a week and then going, oh, the results aren't there. And then I fall off that bandwagon and I start again, right? And, and uh, eating, you know, horribly and what have you and gain a few pounds and then I start all over again. So what I took from it is be consistent in any aspect of your life that you want to see yourself meet your goals and you achieve your dreams. If you are consistent you will hit them when you are not consistent you will fall off you may not get back on and ultimately you will not reach those dreams or you might reach them but it's going to take you a lot longer so the approach is find you know some ways to time block in your calendar make it a priority I make business a priority and so that ultimately is why I succeed in it it becomes you know my number one it goes before pretty much most things except for obviously my family and my own health um, although when I say my own health um, funny enough obviously I it's not taking priority over my eating and my fitness because that is my health so um, so again important to ultimately where you want to see success and you want to see results you need to have a consistent approach and you can do that by time blocking your calendar you can be do that by saying it's a priority and I'm gonna make it that priority and I'm not going to uh, fall from that priority because I want the results and so to get the results you have to know not just do it for a few days, do it consistently. So when you are actually doing, you know, going out to market and looking for a job, looking for a job can be painful. So you need to put in an hour a day every day until you find that job, if not more, but go with an hour a day versus maybe a couple resumes out here once a week and then a couple resumes three weeks later out here. That is going to get you nowhere fast. And so um, put a consistent approach in place and you will see results. Mm -hmm.